Good afternoon, guys. David Hoffman here from David's Bin here, coming at you from beautiful Shiraz, Iran, with my friend, Mr. Hey. Taster. Today, we're going to be exploring the historical center of Shiraz. We got the Citadel, Grand Mosque, Grand Bazaar, and we're going to be eating Hamber, which is really famous in Shiraz. It's hamburger, but they don't use the gear. <laughs> <laughs> it's Shirazi version, and look at my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> And this is the Citadel of Shiraz. So, my man, I haven't yeah. seen that many citadels in Iran yet. This is like the first one I think I've seen, right? Yeah, I kind of started in mid 18th century during the reign of Karim Khan Zand, the founder of Zandia's dynasty in Iran. Okay. It was because Shiraz became the capital uh, in 18th century. And uh, this citadel just was taken as the governor's house during Qajarid period and later on as a prison. So it is very huge and massive construction in the heart of the city. We have the high walls of 12 meters, also the watch towers that are about 14 meters. You can see the very nice brickworks that are quite amazing. Let's go. Everything is in a walking system, actually distance from here. You have the Grand Bazaar, as you said, the Grand Mosque, so everything's okay. always like yeah, this, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Like every city in Iran, it's always right next door to each other. But it's the only one I've seen with this. And guys, just so you know, you gotta start doing this tour either really early morning or late afternoon. Right now it's like 5.30 because here in Shiraz, things open late. Luckily for us, it's summer. You know, sun is still out till around eight. And look at this, yeah, look how beautiful this thing is. Wow, huge, huge fortress. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's go inside the Citadel. Here we go, here we go. Hello, hello. Oh, wow. Oh, beautiful. Nice gardens. So you have a water fountain in the middle, you have all these trees, you have the four towers, and Mr. Taser's taking a risk. <laughs> <laughs> Don't fall in, buddy. <laughs> going to the bathroom. The bathroom? I'm taking a shower, yeah. <laughs> what? The mouse is going this way. <laughs> salam, salam. So this is a hammam. Yeah, this is a hammam. This is the arch bathhouse, basically a hammam, right? A heating room. So in the center we have this fountain. So this is where the steam would come out of, right? You have four areas where you can relax and lay out. I love the architecture. In each area you have different designs. So it's like flowers, birds, You've got different animals over here. All right, let's go to the next room and see what's there. Follow me. The next room is also part of the hammam. So you have two different fountains where the steam comes out of. And then back here, it's a pool. Oh man. <laughs> it's old. It's almost 300 years old, right? Yeah. So that was the bathhouse. Mr. Taster, Grand Mosque, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> I, think, I think we're too tired today. All right, let's go, let's go. Here we go. Look at that, lots of different juices. Over here, snacks, a million different this little. Is oh, that's Sohan. You already had it home. I can't have any more Sohan. No, I can't either. Mmm. Merci. The cardamom, the best cookies on earth, was cardamom. Cardamom, okay. Yeah, sweet, nice and sweet. Look at those donuts. Look at the size of these donuts right here. Oh, right there is the Grand Mosque. Wow, beautiful. It it's closed. Closed. Well, at least we see the facade, right? And over here to the left and the right, we have a lot of shops, right? So everybody's selling carpets, uh, you know, copper work, more souvenirs, right? That's what we got here. Yeah, you can find everything in the Grand Bazaar of Shiraz. And this is the Grand Bazaar right now? This is, that's the entrance. That's right? the entrance yeah. right there? The Wakil Mosque. That's right. Unfortunately, it's closed. The bazaar is also closed. Only some vendors outside the bazaar are open, so we'll see a few of those. But here we have it, right? The colors is what gets me, because they're so different from every other place we've been to. That's right, because this is Shiraz School of Art. As you see, we have the flowers, the nightingales, and it is very different from Isfahan. After the attack of the Mongols to Iran, Tabriz was under the attack and also Isfahan, but Shiraz was not under the attack of the Mongols for the first uh, invasion in that time. That's why we have the prosperity of tile works and beauty and we have the very nice decoration here at the entrance. As you see, we have verses of Holy Quran and also the 
very beautiful geometric design and the very huge door as you see here and the waste design at the entrance that again starts from the earth and goes to the heavens that is the narration of life like i said the bazaar is closed today unfortunately it is a holiday very very unfortunate for me but there are a few shops open right outside the bazaar they have pottery they have souvenirs they have clothing they have spices so any cardamom yes over there over there yeah i'm gonna take some cardamom home okay. like i don't know how much maybe a kilo that's too much <laughs> that's too much is that enough no no it's never enough not enough now with cardamom always the selfies <laughs> Thank you. Mr. Taster, we found a spice shop? Yeah. <laughs> oh, look at this, this is insane. They have so many different things here. This is some berry. Mmm. Cardamom. Oh, it smells amazing. Mm-hmm. Good quality. So is that from the area? India. Oh, it's from India. Yeah. All right, so I bought 100 grams of cardamom. It's roughly $4. It's not actually from Iran. It's from India, but, but I love it. This with everything. This with your tea, with your coffee. It's so good, but I still got to grind it at home. My friend, merci, merci. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you. All right, guys, so because the bazaar is closed and there's nothing really else to see in the area besides those three things, we're going to go to a tomb now. The tomb of? Hafiz. Hafiz, and, yeah, the, and then there's also gardens, right? Yeah, it is a beautiful garden. Okay, let's get in the car, let's right. drive. Okay. Ugh. Let's go, let's go. Okay. Wow, this place is packed. Incredible. Oh, wow. Beautiful gardens. So as soon as you walk into the gardens, then we get to this arcade area where there's a lot of pillars. So you said a few of them are from the 18th century? Four of them are from 18th century. And then we have the reconstruction of the site in 1930s and then in 1960s by the Heritage Organization of Iran. Hafiz was born in 1324 and died in 1391. So the tomb has been here since 1395? Yes, because it was his actual private garden and he was buried here from that time. And then the first time it was Karim Khan Zand who paid very attention to this garden and uh, it was taken as a beautiful garden ever after by Karim Khan and later on by the Heritage Organization of Iran. So once you pass the arcade area, you get here to this part of the garden and in the center you have the tomb. So it's right there where everybody's standing. Yeah. So Hafiz was a lyric poet. Yeah. So that's not the Quran on his no, tomb. No, this has been taken from his divan or from his book. Okay, so the books, the poetry he wrote, yeah, one of right? His poems is the, it, it is named Tidings of Union. The Tidings of Union. Union, Fantastic. Yeah. I mean, this is the best spot uh, to see the whole garden, right? So you can see everything from here, the arcade, all of the gift shops, and then everybody's literally surrounding the tomb. It's amazing. Mr. Taser, what is that? It's tea. That's tea? Yeah. Ali Jan, you taking orders? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to show you. What is that? He's eating corn. Tea vendor wasn't here. He's eating corn. Look at the fire here. Yeah. Woo! It's crazy. The, the dates from Bam. It's dates? Yeah. We're going to have some tea and some dates. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah, it's good. This guy gets selfies all day long. He probably gets hit up like a, by a million selfies on Instagram, this guy. Mm. It's good tea though, right? Yeah. Delicious, very hot, no sugar. Oh, it's perfect. To be honest with you, this is a surprise for me. I've never seen a tea vendor like this with a fire in the middle of a street. <laughs> Piping hot, just like in India. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Good tea, right? Good tea, Shiraz. Good tea, Shiraz. Guy, <laughs> wow. We're gonna try some cotton candy. You wanna try it? Like this? Here, you and me? Oh, mm. oh. Mm. 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 Maybe you can just take bites. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> try it. Oh, I like it. It's actually very tasty cotton kind of candy. David Beckham, David Beckham, play football. Oh, where's it? I love your hat. 
Amazing! The never ending selfie game here. Messi, Oh, 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 This guy's amazing. So nice, so nice. Hey, merci, merci. Amazing tea with the, with the cinnamon. So good. Mashallah, mashallah. All right, let's get in the car. Let's cross, it's too much. Okay, burgers? Burgers, yeah. <laughs> please, please, please. I'm starving. We need a burger. Oh, can't wait, burger. It's not burger, it's burg, right? Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go, let's go. It's nine at night, I'm starving. We're going to the burger spot. Look at this, on the street, there's a guy selling these chickpeas and these, uh, what are the beans, what are these? Broad beans. Broad beans, broad beans. Check beans. Piece, yeah. Oh, that's good, that's good. I think I'm gonna have to try it when we get out. Maybe, maybe. Let's keep going, I'm starving. Okay. Hello, hello. You good? Hello. <laughs> All right, let's go. Mr. Chase is always taking selfies. I'm let's go, let's go. The selfie king. Undisputed. So the dangerous. So this is the burger spot we're going to. It's called Wimpy 110. We're going to the kitchen? Yeah, yeah. All right, let's go to the kitchen. Awesome, awesome. Salam, salam. How are you? <laughs> good night, good night. It's already like 9.30 at night. I'm starving. I need a burger. Let's see how they make it. And this is the beef. Shut this out. Wow. I know this burger is going to be amazing because it's super fresh meat. This was from today, right? That's right. Yeah. Yeah, very fresh. You can see the... From the butcher today. Yeah. yeah, yeah, from the butcher. So next to the fridge? Yeah. Woo! Oh my gosh. Amazing meat. So we got the fresh meat here. It would be kept in the fridge overnight and then tomorrow morning they get us started to make the very fresh hamburger for tomorrow night. So they bring it in here, then they grind it, right? Yes. All right. All right, kitchen, let's go. Okay. Merci, merci. Okay. Into the kitchen. Wow. Hello, hello, hello. salam, salam, salam. Hello. Salam, salam. Alright, here we go, here we go. Woo! So here they're making burgers. Next to them, they're making shawarma, chicken and beef. But these burgers look so juicy. Look at them, they're nice and big. I think they're like maybe six or eight ounces each. They add some cheese, they add different condiments, obviously. And this gentleman right here, he's stuffing it into this nice bun. It's a, I don't even know what that bun is, but it has a sesame seeds on top. Right here, look at this. Oh, it's gonna be good. Yeah. Very fresh. Yeah. Very fresh. Only fresh. Only fresh. Only, only. So fresh. Everything fresh. Yeah. Fresh beef, fresh bread, fresh awadma, everything good. I'm excited. All right, so now he's adding some like salad, tomatoes, celery. Whoop. Oh, this is amazing. Wow, they also have pizzas. How are you? Very good, you? So making the pizza. Yeah, pepperoni pizza. Pepperoni. Yeah. Meat and mushroom and vegetable pizza. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah. Oh, right into there? Yes. That's the forno? Yeah. Oh, wow. Swiss hot dog and cheese and mushroom. Guys, this is amazing. So besides just the burgers and the shawarma, they also have these pizzas and what is that again? Uh, hot dog. That's a hot dog? Yeah. That's like a crazy hot dog. Yeah. That's amazing. This hot dog, this panin, this mushroom, this cheese, and very, very, very good. Very tasty. Yeah. And this place is so packed. Look outside. Lines, huge lines. These guys don't stop making food. I love it. It's not just a burger spot. It's a crazy hot dog spot too. Look at the hot dogs. We're loaded with cheese, got mushrooms. Oh, it's gonna be tasty. Can't wait to go outside. What's up, man? You good? Yeah, let's go, let's go. Merci, merci. Thank you. You guys, the butcher's in there. All right, let's go outside, let's eat. I'm ready. All right, Mr. Taster, we're doing the Hamburg yeah. Shirazi. Hamburg. Hamburg. Hamburg Shirazi. Mr. Taster, are you ready? I am ready, man. Look at that. Oh my god. Mm. Mm. The bun, the salad. Yeah. Mmm. I love it. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. It's a fluffy bun. Mm. The tomato. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Basil, right? Yeah, I love it. Oh, I love it. Mm. It's not a good burger. You know, I'm from America. We eat a lot of burgers. Yeah. But this is good. It's so I had burgers delicious. in New York. Mm -hmm. I love your country as well. I had pizza, pizza, pizza in New York, Manhattan. 
Delicious. Delicious. Oh. Oh. Oh, I love it. Me too. Nothing like fast food. Mm -hmm. Very hungry, yeah? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's very good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, you know what? The sauce. I'm sorry. What sauce is this? It's good? It's very interesting. You know what? Are you ready for spice? I'm not. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Mm. That's spicy. Mild. Spicy. Mmm. Oh my gosh. Only in Chicago. Guys, I'm gonna try this special mayonnaise oh, made by them. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. You like it? Oh, it's good. Oh my gosh, it's a little spicy. <laughs> oh my gosh. What a great meal. Oh, I love it. I'm so happy. Good ending in the Shiraz. Mr. Jason, thank you. Thank mm. you. Mm. I still want to take a bite of that hot dog though. This is what happens when you roll with the taster. You get selfies all day. <laughs> Mr. Taster finishes. I'm going to try this hot dog. Look at how big this is. It's a monster. I have to get a quick bite. Let's try it. The hot dog. Ready? Mm. Mm. It has a nice. Mm. It's got chips in it. Chips, cheese, mushroom, mm. cheese. Oh, it's good. Mm. Mm. This one, the condiments. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mr. Chaser, thank you for the day. We saw the fortress. Sort of bizarre. <laughs> sorry I couldn't join you today. No, no, no you're fine. Yeah. Sorry, so we couldn't make it to Persepolis, but it's fine. We saw all attractions in the city center, then we came here. This is called? 110. 110. Hamber 110. Hamber 110. In Shiraz and mm -hmm. thanks Kuchuk for supporting us. Thank you so much. And thanks Mr. Taster. Yeah, of course. Follow me on YouTube <laughs> channel. And thanks to David for showing our beautiful and amazing country. I love this country. Thank you so much. Love you so much. Guys, if you love this video, thumbs up, comment below, subscribe to my channel, his channel. We'll see you in the next childhood adventure in Lar. In Lar. Tomorrow, Lar, Bastak, and Janah. Mm -hmm. Love you guys.